Do you ever get the feeling that you're being watched? Today, we're going to hide from the carnivore behind me and we're gonna talk about the three different kinds of eaters. So, I'm Dr. Diane from the Discovery Museum and today we're gonna talk about herbivores, carnivores, and omnivores. So what's a carnivore? A carnivore is somebody who eats meat. And carnivores had sharp teeth because they needed it for tearing and ripping at the meat. I have a really good example of a carnivore sneaking up behind me. I will not be the prey to this predator today. So I have a couple of examples of some carnivores here. I want you to get a good close up, take a look at this is a velociraptor skull and check out those sharp teeth. It may be tiny, but it definitely packed a sharp bite. I also have an Allosaurus tooth. Check out how sharp and how long that tooth was. Perfect for ripping into meat. And we have a megalodon or a shark tooth. Imagine meeting the creature that that went with. So all of these teeth have in common that they're sharp, they're pointy, and they're able to tear meat. Now, over here, we've got our herbivores. Herbivores ate plants. And so they had flat teeth that they would use to grind and to um, use the leaves. So for example, this is a mastodon tooth or a mammoth. And so imagine those teeth grinding together as they got the grass into something that they could eat or the leaves into something that they could eat. I also have a Corythosaurus skull and take a look at how flat that is. So you can see that we don't have the sharp pointy teeth of the carnivore. The herbivore has the flat teeth for grinding. There were a few dinosaurs who just like humans were omnivores. Omnivores eat both meat, meat and plants and the omnivores would have a combination of the sharp canine teeth and the flat molars to be able to tear and to chew. And so if you take a look at our avaraptor, you can see in that fossil that we've got a combination of teeth there. So your job today is you're gonna go through the dinosaurs that are in the blog, you're going to do some research about them and you're gonna figure out were they carnivores or were they herbivores?